Morning. Morning, everybody. Have breakfast? Morning, Morning Doc. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes. Good. Then let's open the chest. Good morning, Rudy. Morning. Robin. Hello. Hello. Thank you, LD. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, question? Yes, uh, Dr. Sturgis. Why are we opening the patient's chest? Because this patient has a four centimeter aneurysm of his ventricle. How else would you expect me to get in there? Not so many options. What do you think, doctor? Yes, uh, but you see, he was only scheduled for prostate surgery. What's your name? Um, my, my name is, uh, Dr. Felix Stone, sir. Look, Felix, I can tell you this is a revolutionary technique going through his chest to get to his prostate, but you know I'd be full of shit, wouldn't you? Yes, Wouldn't sir. you? Yes, sir. <laughs> Here's the problem. This patient needs open-heart surgery. The administration of this hospital will only authorize a prostate procedure. Now, what good is fixing his prostate if he has a heart attack every time he tries to use it? Right? Tell him, Sid. Tell him the rule. First the ventricles, and then the testicles. But for those of you who have your heart set on it, there'll be a prostate procedure immediately following this one. Everybody happy? It's just that I thought open heart surgery was no longer, uh, you know, authorized, that's all. Look, Felix, we're here, he's here. Why don't we make the most of this? Right? We can apologize to him once he comes out of the anesthetic. All right? Now, you know, since you're asking all these hard questions, I'm gonna let you make the first cut this morning. Why don't you go scrub up? <sighs> no, thank you. Anybody? Rudy, they never want to make the first cut. <laughs> no cuts, no glory, Sturge. You're the man. All right, here we go. See what I said.